my life is my making. We make our lives, right? And what about, what about the people that have it very hard? What about the people that are exploited sexually? What about the people that have been like in the worst scenarios for many years of, of drudgery? I think it's so unfair. I, I do agree with it, but I think it's unfair to say that this is the responsibility of the individual to be okay. Because for some people no, no, it's no, just you, so much you, harder. You see, I, I made a simple statement, you're making a philosophy out of it. Okay. There are various levels of life happening on the planet. In London city, there are richest people living in highest levels of pleasure and comfort. There are people who are living the worst possible life within this city, yes or no? Yes. You don't have to go all over the world to see that, right here. So, if we create a society, where there is such disparity. I'm asking, both you and me, are we responsible for this? That is my second question. No, no, we'll come, we'll come and just answer the question. <laughs> I'm asking the question now. <laughs> are we? Yes, Maybe we can't change it tomorrow morning, I know that. But are we? If we see we are, we will start working towards a solution. Otherwise, we'll try to make a living out of problems. A whole lot of people in this world have invested so much in the problems, they're only making a living out of problems, evolving philosophies of problems. The only thing that matters is a solution, isn't it? Huh? Not in how many ways we glorify the problem. The only and only thing that matters when there is suffering for a human being is a solution. Yes or no? Whether it comes from up, down, whichever way the hell it comes, who cares? Whether it comes from heaven or hell, we don't care. When somebody is in some state of suffering, the only thing that matters is a solution. So if solutions have to happen, who created the problems? You can say it's this guy or this person or that person. No, no, we as human beings have bread problems, isn't it? When I have a glass of water, I am not willing to share it with the person sitting next to me. Why do you expect a man who has a billion dollars to share it with somebody? I'm asking. Hello? You are not willing to share the little things that you have. You have a philosophy, why are the rich people not sharing it with the poor people? They will not. Because your argument is, but I don't have enough. But even they don't have enough. <laughs> they may have hundred billion dollars, but they don't have enough. That's what you need to understand. This is the nature of human being. You may think they have too much, but they don't have enough. As you don't have enough, nobody has enough in this world. Yes or no? Only thing is just this, that's why I told you, your service, sacrifice, selflessness, all these things, these are all con jobs. That's why I told you, at least what is the worst in you, your greed, expand your greed towards everybody's well-being. We can work towards it. Will all the problems go away tomorrow morning? No, we can only work towards it, isn't it? If all of us work towards it, will it go away? Hello? If every one of us really strive towards it, will it go away? Yes, it will, isn't it? Will it or will it not? It will. But till now, the problem has always been about how to get all the human beings on one page. There are different nations, there are different races, there are different religions, skin color, this nonsense, that nonsense, every kind, all right? For the first time, for the very first time in the history of humanity, Two things have happened. One thing is, our survival is better organized than ever before. There is enough resource, technology, for every problem we have a solution at hand. And for the first time, we can sit here in this room and speak to the entire world. Never before this was possible. See, many people have come, he, he mentioned names, Rama, Krishna, Buddha, Jesus, this one, that one, all kinds of people. When they spoke, hardly ten people heard. Yes or no? This is the first time you can sit here and speak to the entire world. When such a privilege is there, is it not your and my responsibility to say the right things? Right things to put all human being, beings on one page? Hello? If we do this, because never before this was possible, now it is possible. As a generation, will we make it possible or are we just a wine generation pointing fingers at each other and we will die like this? This is the choice we have. This is the reason why I'm going from university to university, though I avoided every damn university when I was your age. <laughs>
Now I am going to university to university because this is an opportunity which is for the first time in the history of humanity that if we want to change something, we can because we have the resource, we have the technology, we have the capability and we can share this with the entire world. Never this was possible. Please let's make it happen.